Hey guys and welcome to my channel. So hi, I'm Royal Sophie and I post videos every single day. In today's video, we're going to be talking about the most overrated items in Royal High and basically my opinion on all of them and if you should trade for them or not. So this video will have timestamps in the description down below and you might be able to see it on the screen as well. So if you just click on those timestamps, you can scroll through to a specific item that you're looking at. First item is the large train bow skirt. Now this was on sale ages ago for 33,000 diamonds, but then it got reworked and at the start it wasn't that pleasing for people, like people weren't as interested in it, but after the rework, like the demand for this skirt went up a lot and because it went off sale after there was a lot of people who were trading literally hundreds of thousands of diamonds for this skirt so i myself traded this and i think another item for a halo people were literally trading halos for this skirt now was it worth it just for a skirt i think that yes because this skirt is very big, it's very extravagant, it's not on sale anymore, and it's very, very pretty and detailed. So the next item we are going to be talking about is the parasol. Now the parasols, there are two versions, the 2020 parasol and the 2019 parasol. So in 2019, this parasol was very popular. It was sold for 52,000 diamonds and it was made by Suki Meki and honestly it is beautiful. It was very cute, very popular and lots of people wanted it. But then in Valentine's 2020 that same parasol came back to the shop except it was the 2020 elegant parasol instead sold for a much higher price of 60,000 diamonds. So the hype for this kind of went down when the second version of it came out but people can still flex that they have two because if you wear them at the same time you can get them to like flash colours and then it will look really cool. I used to do that but now I only have one of the parasols. If you are looking for trade for this I would say the ideal offer is like 100,000, 80,000 so not too much because the demand for it has gone down quite a lot. So the next item, well, group of items that we are going to be looking at is halos. Now halos, they are, well, you know, they're halos. And they are pretty rare. I mean, halos are like something that you wish for, you want to have. And I don't know if you guys watch my movie halo -less, but you should definitely go watch that because it talks about the demand for halos a little bit but basically overpaying for halos is very common now and the price well you can't really put a price on halos specifically because they are all different and they're different rarities i think there's a tier list but to be honest i don't think the tier lists matter that much so halos are pretty overrated but I do see how they're overrated because they are actually really really nice and very very stunning and people just want halos to like flex them show off that they have halos and I mean that's okay but there's a point where like you don't spend a million diamonds on a halo so the last and final item that I'm going to be talking about is the teddy zilla now this was obtained from valentine's 2019 and it was originally sold for 15,000 diamonds. It is very rare. A lot of people want it because it didn't come back in the 2020 Valentine's event. So again, people are literally spending halos on this. So there's like a pretty much common theme here. Most of the items that aren't halos are rare, but most of them are obtained from like 
hardly any diamonds and then their value just went up and i guess that kind of goes to show even if you don't like it it might be really rare and like the demand of everything in world high is changing all the time so the teddy dealer is very very big and i guess that's what it's most famous for and that it's i think it's a stolen mesh so they couldn't bring it back and it might be getting a rework one day so anyway guys that is all of the overrated items for this video i know that there are loads more that i could talk about and if you'd like me to do a part two please leave a like and let me know in the comments down below and i would love to do a part two thank you so so much for watching bye Strawberry cake